I wish you guys were here with me so you could tell me like girl yes, you know girl no But no one is here to help me think Hello my loves, how y'all doing? I hope you guys are doing well If you're new here, welcome, my name is Saifa Please do not forget to subscribe down below and listen, don't end there, okay? This is gonna annoy me Don't end there, subscribe down below and also ring the bell so you're notified whenever I upload a new video, okay? Guys, uh, if you're wondering why my face is already done, I actually did my base on Insta Stories. If you're not following me on Instagram, follow me there for more content, okay? Everyday content, kind of, okay? So today we are doing a very exciting video. Oh my god, I'm so excited that my hands are just moving. We're doing an exciting video. We're going to be unboxing a present. Oh my god, for one of you guys, one very generous, very sweet lady called Hailey. Um, I don't even know what I did to deserve all of this. It's a huge box. Let me show you guys. It's already opened because they opened it uh, customs and stuff. So it's a huge box. I'm not going to show you guys some of her details. So I don't want to show you guys her details. I don't want to blast her details on the internet. But she's so sweet. Hailey Clean. Thank you so much, girl. I feel like I don't even deserve all this, okay? I don't feel like I deserve it. But we have a huge box here. I'm so excited to open it, everything in. I can see some stuff and I'm like, ah, I want to touch it. I want to play with it. I want to do everything with it. So my base is already done. And if you guys see me sweating, best believe it's because it's so hot. It is so, so hot. Normally, whenever I want to film these videos, I'll actually look for a time that is a little bit cooler. And then that's when I'll be like, okay, today's the day. Let me just film a YouTube video, sit down, because I can't on the fan. I can't on the AC. You guys are going to hear the humming no noise, and it's going to be so annoying. So, but I'm too excited today. I can't wait for any cold days. I don't see anyone coming anytime soon, okay? So, it's really hot, and I'm using her letter, her card, as a fan. This is a perfect fan, guys. But we have a card here. I'd love to open it. Oh, she's so sweet. Oh my goodness. Uh, she did ask me if I've tried Colourpop products and then she's like, I'm going to make an order for Colourpop products and I'd like to order for you some since I know it's hard for you to get it and of course it's impossible for me to get Colourpop. When I was in Malaysia, I actually could a little bit because I could order them online. But here in Tanzania, it's kind of impossible. It makes it very, very, very expensive to buy very cheap products, okay? So we have the card here. I dismantled everything because I couldn't open it and I'm very... Um, what do you call it? Oh, YouTube name Haley Kin. So she does have a YouTube channel, guys. Should I read you guys the cards? I hope this letter finds you and that you are doing well. I absolutely love your YouTube channel and enjoy watching you, all of your videos. I hope that you love all the colorful beauty items that I sent. They have become one of my favorite beauty brands. Their super shock shadows are impressive. Um, and the price is... For the price and the pigment i cannot wait to see how you use them i also included some color street nail polish strips oh my god i'm so excited about those i know that they are only available in the us plus canada currently i'm obsessed with them plus i think you'll enjoy them also there are youtube videos on how to apply them they come off easiest with acetone okay i hope you continue to make more videos i especially love your worst review plus tutorials i hope 2020 brings you wonderful adventures health plus wealth Hailey Clean. Oh my god. I hope you don't mind that I read that on camera. It's so sweet. And that's such a cute card. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it because it's so light. It's just so sweet. It melts my heart how sweet people can be. And yeah, because I couldn't get Colourpop easily, even in Malaysia, there was no like Colourpop store or something like that. So I only have used a few of the products. I've used their eyebrow pencil, which I love. I've used some of their lipsticks, which I love. I've heard a lot, a lot about Super Shock Shadows, but I've never been able to get my hands on them. I know you guys have seen those tiny, tiny color pop. I actually ordered them. My aunt was coming from US and I bought them and I sent them to her house. And uh, she took like eight months to come to Tanzania. So can you imagine how much of a struggle that is to buy palettes and wait eight months for them? So it's just so hard for me to get this product. So I'm really grateful that she helped me uh, do this. But she really just didn't have to do all of this. It's too much. So sweet. Oh my goodness. These are super shock shadows. I just removed the package. So these are a few super shock shadows. Extremely beautiful colors. Um, maybe I should open everything with you guys, right? Right? Let's just open them up and see a few of the shades because why not? This is the whole video. And then we're going to actually use some of them on my eyes and whatever she brought. Whatever I can use on my eyes and on my face, we're going to use them together, okay? So try some of them out. I can't wait. This is the shade um, Onset. So it's a green shade. It's super duper beautiful. I hope you guys can see that very well. Oh my goodness. 
super sock shadows are so hyped around and for an actual reason what is that that is gorgeous we can't do this to all of them i see a lot of stuff here so if we do this we're gonna take forever would you like me to do that i don't even know drift oh my god oh my god Hey, that is gorgeous i want to touch it again but i can't i can't i can't do all of them so let's just go through them the next shade is uh chirp which is an orange shade everything looks gorgeous they're all they're, none of them are matte so they're all like pretty much nice and shiny oh my goodness yes we have so many super super shock shadows i think these are her favorites so this is a plug life gorgeous next a shade ripple is a purple it is insane look at that i hope you guys on camera can see the actual shine i really want to touch this one also <gasps> that's super duper beautiful oh my goodness um there's a shade in um uh, juvia's place um something palette i filmed a makeup collection video and i talked about this shade from juvia's place that is an amazing topper for like purple shades this is actually similar but this is better the purple shade here is actually better than the one i really love that i showed you guys in that video amazing this is the shade bay it just looks so stunning it's like a dark oh my goodness that is gorgeous that is just gorgeous. Whoa. Time. The flies. I'm going to kill you. There's just too many. They're so annoying. Without the fan on, I can just see them all. There's no food here. What do you want from me? So uh, we have another pack of six. Oh, my God. This was, like, already enough. Like, girl, thank you, Haley. Roy G. Biv. I'm kind of confused as to what I'm going to use because I feel like using all of this and there's just no time. Let me open it up for you guys so you can see better. OG Bib is gorgeous. It's a pinky shade with lots of um, golden glitter. I love those shades. And then we have a red one, which is Hotty Totty. This is a hot, hot pink. I'll do a swatch of all the Super Shock shadows so you guys can see them. Okay, that is Hotty Totty. Amazing. We have another one called Rose Garden, which is a purple. Gorgeous. I found none that I actually dislike. Okay, none. Set to stun. And these are all $6 each, so they're not expensive at all. This is set to stun. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Okay, I think I have to do something about the flies. I have to do something. Okay, I added a little bit of uh, mosquito repellent. We should also kill the flies, I hope. They're still there though. They're still there. From the they're so strong. Let's just continue on because I'm too excited. This shade is a golden shade called Takini. Oh my goodness. Takini is gorgeous. Okay. It's a golden, beautiful shade. Oh my god, that is stunning. And we've finished. No, we're another one. Coconut. Coconut is blue. How do they come up with this shade names, huh? Coconut? Blue? that's gorgeous okay another shade now we've, we're done with those six and we have another six these are the shades right here this is called my harmony God, what am i even gonna do today like what am i gonna do i have to do a few looks trying the super shock shadows because they need they need their own oh my god Cutologist. It's kind of reddish. Oh, they're all just amazing. What is that? So beautiful. This is another one called Empire. And this is a blue, a green. Oh my god. It's so matchy matchy with my shirt. Maybe we should go that route today. Oh, I, just, I just, I can't. I can't help but, but touch them. I can't help it. Another one is orange. And this is called Bumblebee. Bubble. Bumblebee, not bumblebee, bubblebee. Um, this is orange. I can just imagine that all over the lid. And this one, it looks a little bit different. It's from the Hocus Pocus line. Forever Bewitching. Packaging is also a little bit different on this one. That's why it looks like. Runyon. Runyon. R-U-N-Y-O-N. This shade. Oh, gorgeous. Runyon is gorgeous too. 
so beautiful everyday shade so that's it i think for the super shock shadows unless i see more but we have this this is like a double double super shock shadow maybe it's duo one's green and the other one is she's gorgeous <laughs> the other one is just gorgeous it comes in two one is ladybird and the other one is mint for you would be gorgeous in the inner corner oh my god it has so much reflection it's gorgeous this is ladybird i i can imagine using this all the time for the inner corner if i don't want it all over the lid that's mint for you and then we have some blushes my back is hurting so i'm sitting back we have some blushes how many three blushes pressed powder blush oh my god this looks like a shade i'm gonna be obsessed with this one is forever yours oh my god the packaging is so beautiful the texture is so beautiful and how cute are these hearts um how do you open this how do you open this oh yes oh yes oh yes this is forever yours this is probably what i'm going to be using oh my god more purple it's called baby cake this looks like it's a it's a bit too dark for me but I'm going to try it out and see if I can use it. I don't know if I'm going to be able to use that on my face. But I'd probably use it as an eyeshadow. These are so cute. Oh my goodness. And we have the third one here which maybe I can use. Um, it's called Text Me. It looks a little bit lighter than the purple one. That's like my favorite. This is also dark. But I could get away with like topping it off if I really want like a really strong blush. So cute. Next. Um, fourth ray. This is not from Colourpop. Fourth Ray is also with Colourpop, right? Fourth Ray Beauty. This is a moisturizer plus lip mask duo. Oh my god. How did she know I really want a lip mask? Oh my god. Oh my god, yes. So we have a moisturizer for the lips from Fourth Ray Beauty. This comes in a pack of two. So this is the moisturizer and this is the lip mask. Like, I would love a lip mask. Oh my god. Oh my god, yes. I don't know why I want to keep the packaging. I'm just crazy that way. Look at that. These two together. Oh my god, I can't wait to try that. I'm going to try it out and I'm going to give you guys a review of them. The moisturizer is called Good, is in Good Mood. And the lip mask, overnight lip mask, is in Strawberry. I hope you guys can see that well. That's just amazing. Can I do the hair? Mm, yeah. Mm. Yeah. Thank you. Love that. And we have, now this is called Orchid You Not. The packaging is stunning. It looks like maybe it's from the Halloween collection. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just, I'm just guessing, okay? I'm just guessing, guys. The palette is just so stunning. The color is just so gorgeous. Very deep. Orchid You Not. Which is how gorgeous is that? Oh my god, I love it. And it has a nice mirror. I don't even know what to use today. That is gorgeous. The other one will go with my shirt. So I'm going to go use something else. Okay. Now we have more super shock shadows. This looks like more super shock shadows. This is another super shock shadow duo. So these shades look amazing. First of all, that packaging is stunning. And then the shades inside look nice and deep and dark. That is the shade Golden Age. Oh my god. It's a dark shiny oh god it's so beautiful for a smoky eye Jin Ricky oh no this broke it's the only one that broke it's so gorgeous oh no but it's not the whole thing is not broken just a little bit of it which is now falling on the on the box right here next we have another eyeshadow palette this is secret admirer I actually saw someone yesterday on YouTube using this for like a Valentine's look I think I so, saw that they use this so i don't know if it's new secret admirer oh my god these looks like shades i would use like daily so beautiful the shade um all night is something i'd use all the time the shade everlasting is something i could use all the time with love something i could use all the time these are just gorgeous and this like that there's such a deep shade in here to deepen things up this is like a full look it also has a really light shade that could be like your inner corner and everything basically this is like a full palette you can do your whole look without actually having to pull out another palette which i ex extremely love adore adore that adore it so that's secret 
admire pins. This is two hair clips. Gorgeous, so cute. Let's open one up and see if I can wear it. Oh my god, they're so cute in little heart shapes and they're kind of like candy. They look like those sweet um, gummy bear candies which have sugar like on top. Yeah, that's what it looks like, candy. I want to eat it. I'm getting hungry actually. So you can put that like on your scarf. Is the heart shaping upwards? Yes. Oh, that's so cute. That's super cute, yes. Yes, thank you girl for adding even that on here. Now, okay, let's look at another palette. And another palette. And another Super Shock. What? We have more? No. Super Shock cheeks. Oh, these are cheek blushes. Oh my god, I love blushes, guys. <gasps> this looks a little bit dark for me, but I hope it works. It's so gorgeous. This you can just use even as an eyeshadow because it's matte too. This is gorgeous. I might actually use that. That actually might work. Yeah, I like that a lot. I think I'm going to try that. I don't even know what I'm going to try today. Guys, if I don't try it in this video, I'm going to try it in another video, okay? So just stay tuned for another video of us trying out new um, Colourpop products. This is gorgeous. Look at that packaging. So beautiful. And that colour is definitely something I would use a lot. Like this would be for the, all the natural days, which best believe it or not, I'm always, almost always natural. So this is beautiful. That's like for a full blown out look where I really want my cheeks to like be the center of attention. That will work, that will work. Like that. look at that paint, so cute. So we're done with those and we have another palette. So beautiful, this is a green palette. So it's something that I could use I think today. The packaging is all green so I'm expecting the colors inside to be green as well, right? I can't wait to use all this stuff. I'm gonna use it with you guys on camera too. Because how many videos can I make using all of these? But of course, I will do my best. Lush. Gorgeous. And we have a few shades in here. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, 10, 11, 12. <gasps> yes. It's not actually that green. We do have green shades. But it's actually not like fully green. Let's take a shade in here that I really want to touch. Um, it's Paradise. Let me just get rid of that. It's Paradise. I'd rather, I'd rather, oh my god, yes. Oh my god, yes. Um, let's play that right over here. Oh my god, it's so bright. It's really bright, right? That's so bright. My swatches, excuse my swatches. Let's take a look at another eyeshadow palette so we could be done with eyeshadows. This is Jaclyn Hill Armed and Gorgeous. I actually have Jaclyn Hill palettes like this. This is from Morphe. I actually have one that's um, purplish shade. You will see it if you check out that other video, but which I think right now I'm gonna post on the other channel. The makeup, um, the makeup collection. So if you're not following me on the other channel, the link is always down below in the description. Uh, these are gorgeous. I know them. Oh my god. Oh my god. I've actually never seen this in real life, but I've seen it on camera so many times. This looks gorgeous. These are gorgeous. This is like an everyday palette, except for the green, which is top secret, which is something I think I would use, you know, when you're in the mood. Let me actually t touch VIP because that's calling my name. I want to see if it's silver. It's white. It's actually quite white. Is it like a white and a gold? Let's just um, try it right over there. It's actually more white and silver, but mainly white, like right over there. It's quite reflective. That would be gorgeous on the inner corner, right? Inner corner highlight. So these are nail strips. I would definitely not know how to use them. There's something. I don't know what this that is, but it seems to be important. Oh. She brought so many with so many different colors. So, purple, green, another purple, but this is more like clear purple. Oh God, what is that shiny? I love that. Oh God, oh God, that is gorgeous. Orange, silver, and that is, ooh, ooh, it's like flowered. So these are 100% real nail polish strips, 16 long lasting strips. Uh, yeah, color, street, easy apply, easy peel and apply. That looks amazing for me. Okay, that is amazing for me. I'm gonna try them, them out and see how easy they are to use. So if you'd like to see a video of me trying out how to use those, 
Let me know, it might be a mess, but I've never tried uh, strips before, have I? No, I have never. I've actually never, and this really is so exciting to try. Oh my god, girl, thank you. Thank you so much. I'm gonna keep saying thank you so much because I can't even believe you brought all this stuff. Oh. Alright, I think what we have left is... Oh god! A beauty blender! Oh, how did you even know I need beauty blenders? Oh god. How did you know I just need sponges in general? Oh my god, thank you so much. Um, we have Colourpop lippy sticks. I've used these before. Yes, I've used Colourpop lippy sticks. We have three shades here. Oh, it's actually black inside, not black grey. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, yes. This is actually a colour that I want to put on my lips right now. Can I do that? Would you let me? Would you let me? I love that colour. Let's try that, that out. This is in the shade Best Intentions. I'm going to try it out. Why not? Oh, yeah. Ah, uh, yes. So moisturising. So soft. Oh, God. If anyone knows me knows how obsessed I am with lipstick, like, I could just, I could just buy a hundred lipsticks. I love them so much. That shade is beautiful. That shade is me in a tube. I love that. I love that so, so much. Oh my God. This is in the shade Energy Field. They all have the same packaging inside. This is quite a deep and dark shade. Beautiful. Yes, yes, yes. Of course, this is not an everyday shade. This is for the days you want to look that, like that girl, okay? Like that girl it sticks but inside is actually the same packaging this looks like another shade i am gonna be obsessed with yes this is another everyday shade now if i didn't put the other one on i'd put this on but i'm gonna show you guys um how it looks like okay that's gorgeous should i put that on I'm confused maybe at the end of the video we'll actually change it to that one okay i actually love that one okay uh we're done with the lip lippy sticks there's three of those. Thank you so much, girl. I love lipstick anytime, any day, anywhere. Oh, we have a few more lipsticks. Oh my God, I'm so excited. This is lip cream, actually. I love those two. I love the ones from NYX Cosmetics. Uh, the shade Canes is my favorite, favorite. Ooh, but I like this color. You are mine beautiful i think i might like it i think i need to clean my nails they look just disgusting now with all the shadow i'm sorry if that looks uh, horrifying to you but i'm gonna wash my hands right now yes i think i like that color i'm trying it on can't actually see it because i have that oh but it looks beautiful yeah yeah let me add more let me add a bit more this is the next shade that we have, which is the same lips. Heaven, oh god, oh god, that's another gorgeous one. She nailed it with the lipsticks, okay? Um, are we done? I think we're done, guys. Yay, we are done. I hope you weren't bored all this unboxing. I had the most fun. Thank you so much, Haley, again and again and again. We are done. These are just boxes of the lipsticks. So everything came, okay, okay, boxes, 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 yeah. Everything is done. I have not tried the um, these. I'm going to try them in a different video because I really am so excited to try those. So I'm going to try them in a different video. My nails are actually very short right now. I kind of cut them off just a few days ago. So I'm not going to put them on now because can you put them longer? I'm not sure. Can you like make them longer? Because I'd like that, but a bit longer. And my nails do grow long, so I'll just wait a few days and see if we can try that on. So I'll put that back inside so I don't want to lose whatever that little thing is. And we're done. It's time to do the eyes. Yay! I'm so excited. Are you guys excited? Look at that lips. I'm just getting more and more hyped up. Hype, okay? Okay, since my face is completely... I brought you guys closer. Since my face is completely done, I am going to link everything that I use down below. So that's my face. I'm going to add a little bit of blush. Should we do it before the eyeshadow? Maybe not. Or maybe yes. Let's, let's do that. Let's do that, okay? Let me choose a blush brush. This is a blush brush from Morphe Cosmetics. This is the E3. It's super soft, super fluffy. This is like my favorite brush to use for my blush, which I use all the time. That's like the only brush I use on my face for blush. So... This is in 
Tinkerbell, okay? Maybe we should use Tinkerbell. Although I really want to use the other one too. We use both, okay? We'll use both. On the go, I do love mirrors. So I'm going to put a little bit of that and I'm going to tap it up because I don't know how pigmented that actually is. Oh, it's very pigmented. Oh, it's very pretty. Oh my goodness. It's gorgeous. Yes, that is gorgeous. That is gorgeous. Oh my God, I love it. I did go ham, it's kind of pigmented, so tread lightly if you're not into blush, but I am very much. I wanted to mix a few shades to try them out, but I, I have enough, okay? This is more than enough. So for my eyeshadow today, we are going to go into something more greenish, maybe. So let's start with this palette right here. I'm going to actually use the palette today. Okay, those are all the brushes I brought close to me, so I'm actually going to use a fluffy brush. Not ideal maybe, but let's just see for what I'm going to do. The powders are quite um, powdery. Like, let me see if I can show you guys. There's a lot of pow uh, fallout in that powder, as you guys can see. Um, so I'm going to tap that off because I don't want that to go all over my face. And just, this is not the brush that's going to work for that. I need something a bit more dense. So maybe I'll use this tiny brush here. This is also from Morphe. It's the M321. The flies are back for sure and just lightly add that. It looks very dark on the palette but okay you just need to pack on a lot more to get the kind of pigment that you want. We're going to be testing how blendable these shadows are. The pigment is definitely there so I'm trying to just add it like right where I kind of want it because I don't want this to go everywhere. And then I'm going to use the fluffy brush and see how much I can blend this to kind of go where I want it to go. It's not the easiest to blend up, I'm gonna tell you that much already. So maybe I'm gonna add a little bit more of that on the brush to kind of pack the shadow and blend at the same time. You know, that's that's how you're gonna try and make it blend a lot more. Because otherwise if you just pack it, it doesn't want to move as much. So yeah, you can see it now moving with adding that shade like right on the brush so try different techniques with your shadows to see how they move some of them you can just place them and move them others like this one doesn't want to move actually it's actually patching off so i'm not in love with this shade right now i just work with it that means some shades like this this is is it's more like a pigment than a shadow some shades like this just need a tiny bit more work than others it's a little bit orangish, a little bit yellowish. It's this shade at the top, right here. Echo. Okay, I think now, yeah, I think we're getting there. I think we're finally getting there, so thank God we got there at the end. Oh God, that was hot. I'm not even gonna lie, that was hot. I have a really dark shade in here, but I'm actually really scared to use it right now because I don't think it's going to be easy to blend on top of this green shade. I want it to go darker, but if I do, I'm afraid I'm going to look so choppy um, with this shade. So I think I'm actually going to leave it at that, like that's the darkest shade we're going to use. If I should go darker, there is like a shade here that was nearly black, but this is typically not the kind of shades I would use on the outer corner, like a shiny black on the outer corner. But do I want to try? Do I want to risk it all? It's super shiny though. Super duper shiny. It's so pretty, but it's super shiny. This is the shade. If you see it right here, the black is quite shiny. So it's not something that I want to put like in the outer corner of my eyes. Should I? I wish you guys were here with me so you could tell me. Like, girl, yes. You know, girl, no. But no one is here to help me think. I would never. I would never do this. But I'm gonna. I'm there. I'm gonna. Oh, should I? Okay, I'm just gonna put a little bit of that. Oh no. No, I shouldn't have. I knew I shouldn't have, but I did it anyways. It's okay, we're already there. We're already there. This point of the video is not to actually come out looking so great, I guess. Sometimes you just gotta sh try the shadows, right? This would be so stunning, like on top of a smoky eye, like oh my goodness. I actually really love that. It's actually so dark. Let me bring you guys a little bit closer so you can see my eyes a lot better. Like that looks beautiful, right? Like, I mean, the shade is beautiful. 
for a smoky dark eye but you want to make it like shiny for an in outer corner i just wouldn't use such a shiny shade but we already did it we're already there we can't change our minds right now it's not the worst it's not like it looks bad or anything but it's just not something i'm used to but you definitely cannot remove remove this shiny glitter that is right here over here right now okay it doesn't look bad it doesn't look bad and i and because these are like a glitter shades they're really easy to blend really very easy to blend i don't know about the super shocks that are matte like how's that pigment but that doesn't look bad right it doesn't look bad someone in the comments the other time i posted a look um i asked for a green look on my um worst reviewed makeup and someone asked for a green look on my worst reviewed makeup and someone commented down below like who looks good in green makeup and i was like i like it i do i like colorful looks and green dark greens just look so beautiful i love them i'm not gonna lie i'm not gonna pretend i don't so this shade here this is golden age beautiful 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 i don't know if i should do a cut crease maybe i will let me just do a cut crease really quickly and then continue on with the the eye because i haven't done a cut crease in forever i'm not gonna lie i i don't even know if i still know how to do them that's how long i haven't done a cut crease oh my j oh my god oh my j oh my j oh my j i haven't done a cut crease in so long i feel like i can't I'm gonna like front or skip or anything that was quick how did i do that magic that feels like magic i'm so proud of myself um, there's no need to even like fast forward or skip or anything on that part of how i just did that that was too easy i don't know what happened i don't know what happened i'm not that much of an expert okay i don't know what happened so i'm gonna use there's a few greens here there's a darker green this this is a like a lighter green called onset I don't think that's what I'm going to use. It's actually a little bit blue. These shades are just insanely beautiful. I'm shook. I am shook. And this one is what I think I'm going to use. This is Empire. Yes. Yes. Yes, 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 yes. yes. That's what I'm going to use. I need another brush for that. I'm going to use that green and I'm just going to kind of pack that. What? Pack that on. So shiny and glistening and gorgeousness, gorgeousness. <laughs> what? 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 I'm gonna take. Um, let me try packing that on with my finger and see if we'll get more. Cause more is more. Actually, we have quite a good amount with a brush. You don't need to use your finger. But I'm just being extra, okay? So much fun now i'm gonna go into a gold i'm gonna look for a gold shade in here that maybe this one this is super bright this is called takini i just want to try it out because i'm curious it's a gold shade but it's a very light light gold shade so i'm gonna try takini or we could use that palette and see the shiny shades from that palette i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm sorry i'm just gonna use because we tried the green in this palette let's just use let's see what the shimmer shade would look like so i'm gonna take the gold the color it's paradise it's like a gold but kind of a deeper gold than the one i was intending to use right over there so this is not a super super shock shadow but let's just see what that would look like right over there so i can see that they do it their shimmers like really really bomb because that is amazing from that palette like more than i liked the the green shade that's just beautiful there's, there's nothing wrong with that one okay all right i like it right now i look like a little bit of a crazy mess but uh, i think i hope let's just hope and think that at the end everything is going to be looking beautiful let's put some eyeliner and uh, i'm going to do the other eye I'm 
Love them. I'm going to go get the medicine again. I'm sorry, guys. I'm just so irritated by the flies. Okay, I put the smoke. It's the insect repeller right behind the camera. Will it come to the camera? I don't know. Will it kill me? I also don't know. Let me do the other eye um, without talking. So just enjoy a little bit of music right now. And let's do this. Okay, at this point I thought okay why is it looking so much more like chunkier and glittery on the other eye and not on this eye so I was adding more glitter that glitter chunk from the super shock shadows on this eye and I dropped some of the glitter on the lash and it just stuck there so I'm super pissed at myself but from now onwards you're just gonna see that yellow thing right on my lash line it's so annoying it's so annoying I filmed another video after this and I just deleted it because all I could see is that yellow glitter there and it looks like my lashes like coming off or something i just didn't notice it so yeah just let's ignore it okay just don't look at it okay i'm so sorry yeah but it's done okay so those are the eyes it was actually so much easier to just do that because i know what's going on and oh my god i love it why does the yellow look like more pigmented and like a bit chunky on this eye than the other eye i'm trying to make this chunky too but 